Beautiful. Now that's only the first one. That is only the first one. This mask off of me real quick. So I could better communicate with our followers and people that are just joining or finding out about Classic Steel Auto Works. So, now that I got this off, thanks for following us. Thanks for watching this video. A uh, little bit about this build. This is a 1995 Ford Mustang convertible that we are working on right now. It is a custom build. Uh, the vehicle had an original six-cylinder 3.8 uh, Ford motor in there with a very boring transmission. So this car is being built for a very special client of ours. Uh, I won't disclose his name unless he tells me it's okay. But we are actually taking a very boring looking white convertible Mustang V6. And we are going to convert it into a V8 5.0 custom color, custom uh, ground effects on this car, custom stripes, custom suspension. We're going to make this thing uh, nice and fast. And we do things the right way, guys. I want to give you an example here. We'll flip the camera over. Now, when we do a paint and body, we do a paint and body. Every single square inch of this vehicle is shot with paint and clear coat. This is an example of good workmanship. This is the back of the trunk. You do not see any part of this because this is all covered in plastic and clips and everything else. But when we paint it, we want to make sure that we paint every square inch of this vehicle. Here are the doors. Here are the door jams. We just don't do jams. We do the complete, complete, complete uh, door itself. Uh, obviously, for those of you who do know cars, where you see the taped off paper, that is actually where the, um, the door uh, panel will go. So, I mean, this is an amazing custom color that I created for this client. Um, it's a combination of a few colors with my own spin on it. Uh, this could be compared to a burgundy uh, brandy color. Um, I decided not to go with a candy color because uh, I don't think the builds, um, you know, what I have in store for this car are actually, you know, I don't want it having candy. I actually want it to have a nice, uh, very, very beautiful paint job with a very good clear coat on it. So here we are. I'm actually real excited to get the, get this build on its way. We are actually progressing on this uh, real fast. Um, we are using, for those of you who don't know, I do use a network of body shops that are in my network. That way we can get these cars churned out. The great folks at SoCal Auto Body here in Arlita, they are located off of Brantford. They are part of my network of body shops that produce these cars for me. So I come up here, I check on them, I make sure that the jobs are done uh, to my standards. I take a lot of time away from my day to make sure that these are done correctly. So again, big shout out to SoCal Auto and Body here in Arlita. These guys do an amazing job. If you guys got any uh, collision jobs, any insurance jobs that you guys need done, come see these guys, ask for Rob. He's an amazing person to deal with. If you need more info about SoCal Auto, please DM me and I'll give you all their information. I trust them with my builds. I trust them with my brand. So that's that. So thank you, Rob, and the good guys here at SoCal Auto Body for doing what you guys do. Again, we have about four to five body shops that are in our network. They are our providers. Uh, we also have a few mechanic shops that are also in our network. So the whole moral of the story is I'm trying to get these cars done in a timely, timely manner. It took um, a few years for me to come up with a system to uh, get these cars done with quality, time efficiency, and at the end of the day for the client to really, really like uh, the job. So here we are. We actually are getting ready to shoot the second coat of clear coat. We don't mess around with the clear coat here, guys. We use enough of it, okay? Materials are no option for us because if you're paying top dollar to have that custom car done to your preference, 
there is no Mickey mousing the materials. We use it all. Okay, so this car is probably going to have about three to four um, coats of clear coat. A lot of people will say that's excessive. I say it's not. And the reason for that is when this car gets detailed throughout the years, when this car gets polished throughout the years, I want to have enough material on that car, enough clear coat for that owner to enjoy for many, many years to come. For those of you who know, if you skimp on clear coat, you're going to get um, pretty bad results within five years. P pretty bad. I mean, the sun could damage it. Next thing you know, you're flaking and cracking. So we don't do that here at Classic Steel Auto. We like to make sure we use quality, quality materials and give the client what they're looking for. So if anyone has any questions, just go ahead and shoot it here on the comment sections. Hey guys, do me a favor. It only takes a quick second. Hit that follow button, smash that like button. Help me bring some beautiful car content to TikTok. The whole uh, idea is that I bring some beautiful car content for all of those people that are interested in American classic cars, muscle cars, European sports cars. Follow us. We have a lot of material coming your way this year. We've made a lot, a lot of changes to our protocol here. We made a lot of changes to our business. Um, and you know what? We're going to start bringing in some very good car content. So, guys, I'm not begging. I'm just asking. Hit that follow button if you're not following us. Smash that like button. It helps TikTok spread out this beautiful content to people that uh, aren't familiar with Classic Steel Auto Works. So we are Classic Steel Auto Works. We work on American muscle cars, classic cars, some European cars, not all. Uh, I'm a very, very, um, uh, I put it this way. I like the BMWs from back in the day and also the Mercedes is from back in the day. I'm talking 60s, 70s maybe early 80s. So if you have something out there that you want me to do, hit me up. But our profession and our expertise is in the American muscle cars and classic cars. So we have one, I believe is mixing up some clear coat, but he's checking his phone, which is, that's cool. Can't miss any text. There's one right there. Say, what's up, one? What's up? What's up? He's getting ready. We're going to be pumping another coat of clear coat. I'm going to keep this live going, guys to kind of show you what, uh, how the process works. It's a lot of work. And by the way, these guys are amazing at keeping this paint booth immaculate. There is no excessive dust, no excessive debris on the floor. You know, we don't want any debris or any what we call trash onto our finished product. It just takes a lot of time away uh, at the end to fix, and we don't like that. We'd rather take enough time to go ahead and prep these cars correctly Prep the paint booth correctly, keep the temperature at where we like, use quality materials, and take our time. Guys, this is amazing for a first coat. This is the first coat of clear coat, guys, and it is amazing. I want you guys to see what magic happens when we shoot the second coat. Uh, we're waiting on the flash time on this. It is about 10 minutes to 15 minutes at the temperature we're at right now. Um, once this thing gets a little tacky, which I think it already is, I've just been doing this long enough to know visually. Um, she's actually ready for another coat within a couple minutes. So I'll keep this live going as we speak. Uh, if anyone has any questions or uh, anything you'd like to share, go ahead and put it in the comment section, and I will be happy to discuss it. Again, this is a 1990, and I will be happy to discuss it. Again, this is a 1990. And I will be happy to discuss it. Again, this is a 1990. We are going to do a custom job on this. This will be a custom build from Classic Steel Auto Works with a 5 liter V8 in it, 6 speed, a manual transmission, high performance clutch, custom suspension, big brakes in the front and the back. And we're going to go with some beautiful wheels. I can't disclose my wheel selection yet, but let's just say for those of you who are familiar with the Mustang, uh, Celine, or the SVTs from back in the day, uh, I'm going to go with a sort of a wheel <clears throat> that's period correct for it. However, we're going to go ahead and um, we're going to go ahead and stagger the wheels. That way we have a nice stance on this thing. So it, it's also important that, you know, no matter how fast this car is going to get, we want it to break and we want it to handle just as well. I'm going to go ahead and put my mask on because I think uh, Juan, the maestro, is ready to shoot. Let's check on him real quick. Oh, yeah, he's ready. He's getting hyped up. 
He is getting hyped up. That's what I like. So, you guys get to watch me put a mask on while I'm trying to record. I apologize. Look at that. Let me get this sucker on real quick. I don't want any uh, any ailments. I still got. I, I think I still got another uh, 15 good years in me. I'm not sure. We'll see. You never know. Life is funny. Give me a second here, guys. All right, some video. Let me shoot some video. Here we go. All right, that is a. For those of you, uh, I don't know if you can hear me or not. I'm muffled because I have a mask on, but this is a Ford color. However, I put my spin on it. I added a few more. Um, let's just say secret ingredients. So you guys won't be able to hear me now. The fans are on. Enjoy the content. Here we go. Second coat coming on, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Second coat.
All right, guys. So, Mr. Juan, and uh, he ran out of clear coat, so he's just filling up. So, I'm going to go ahead and take that time and take advantage and show you guys the amazing, amazing um, quality so far. Um, I don't see any trash in this thing yet, no blemishes. He's doing an amazing job. The guys here at SoCal Auto and Arlita, if you guys need some quality, quality collision work, check these guys out. I believe they're on TikTok. I believe they're on Instagram. I'm going to go ahead on a future video and go ahead and link up uh, their contact information. So uh, SoCal Auto does belong to our network of body shops. So they provide body and paint service to um, my brand and uh, my company. So it's amazing because we like to use independent body shops from around the uh, neighborhood. And these people have to meet my stringent, and I say my very stringent requirements on doing any of my cars. And these guys pass with flying colors. They do amazing work. And I'm so ecstatic right now looking at the finished product so far. Uh, let me go ahead and flip the camera over. I mean, guys, this is amazing, you know? The color is an amazing color. Um, I kind of put my spin on it a little bit because I want to give my client a, um, a very unique, unique and beautiful looking car at the end of the day. So let me go ahead and get my face mask on. There we go. All right, I could take this face mask off again. We just got done spraying the second coat of clear coat um, on the hood, underneath the hood, uh, door jams, door itself. Uh, again, guys, I want to remind you that when we do a repaint, we just don't paint the surface. I mean, we disassemble the car. I mean, here's an example. These doors are off of the car. The hood is off of the car. The trunk is off of the car. And believe it or not, we actually pulled the motor and transmission out of this car also because I wanted to do a custom color for the engine bay. When I say custom, it's a black color, but, you know, I kind of like to add my own spin on it. Uh, here's an example, guys. So uh, there it is right there. That is the 1995 Mustang convertible again. I'm shooting out of the paint booth so you guys see the glare of the light. Um, that was a original uh, white color car. And um, it is an automatic, it was an automatic, excuse me. Uh, and it was a V6. However, no more. That thing's going to get a high performance 5 liter V8 in there with a 5, possibly 6 speed manual transmission with an amazing clutch suspension work and brakes and wheels and tires and a body kit to match. So 
Uh, this will not look like any Mustang out there. It's going to have its own look to it. Uh, I'm trying to keep it very tame. However, remember, guys, my thought on this build is muscle car. So this thing is going to look like a muscle car uh, opposed to any other car with spoilers on it, you know, which looks fast sitting. We don't want that. We want this car to be very subtle, very clean, very unique, very beautiful. However, I want this car to perform as amazingly as possible for the client. Again, this client is a very special client of mine. He is my friend. Uh, he will soon be uh, involved more in our brand. I want to show him that we can produce anything he likes to his liking um, with no, no shortcuts. Again, guys, there it is. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video right now. Guys, if you have not, please do me a favor. It only takes one second. Hit that follow button. Smash that like button. Help me bring some beautiful car content to TikTok. I know TikTok's a very crazy, crazy platform. I mean, you can watch people scratch a balloon and, you know, uh, I don't know, do some stupid shit on the microphone. I don't do that. This is strictly American classic car hot rod sports car content. This content is for your car enthusiast, your weekend car builder, your um, person with dreams about their car. Um, if I can help you uh, kind of manage your own build, why not? Hit me up, DM me. I do apologize with my schedule. I might get back to you within a couple of days, maybe even a week, but I will get back to every single one of you that has any questions or need any advice on any builds. So just to paraphrase what we have going on here, uh, let me go ahead and flip the camera over real quick. We have a 1995 Ford Mustang convertible, originally a V6 3.8 liter V6 Ford motor uh, with an automatic transmission. Uh, it is your plain old white. However, we are not doing that, guys. Here at Classic Steel Auto Works, we customize our stuff. We give you something that somebody else does not have. That is our goal, is for you to have a one-off car. And the vision can go as deep as you like. The vision could be as creative as you like. It all depends on... Uh, what your um, outcome in your mind is for your car. Now, I am lucky. Uh, over 90%, I would say, of my clients, my customers, they let me run wild with my creativity. They give me so much freedom as far as, you know, picking the color. Like, for instance, this color right here, my client, he trusted me uh, to pick a color that's going to best suit his car. Uh, and... Well, surprise, surprise, um, this is a beautiful color, guys, an amazing color. So there we go. So, guys, hit that smash, uh, smash that like button. Please follow us. I will be shooting another live video here uh, momentarily. Uh, for those of you who like to continue watching, please do. We're getting another coat of clear coat ready. Let me see my boy Juan here. He's getting it ready right over there, mixing it up. We're going to be putting some wet, wet on these panels, guys. So there it is. I love what I do. It's an amazing industry to be in. Um, it took me a, almost five to six years not to learn this, but to uh, learn what works as far as time management. And it also took me a while to figure out a winning formula. I figured it out, guys. Let me help you build your dream muscle car, classic car, sports car. At the end of the day, let me bring your vision to life. Let me push that car of yours to the finish line. For those of you who are interested, uh, my Instagram is, hooked, I believe, linked up to uh, our TikTok account. DM me all our shop information's out there. There's a methods of reaching me. Um, and let's discuss getting your car done correctly. There it is. Now it is bring your went. They were just here. But the shot of the shop here. 
And here is a wide shot of what we got going on out here. Beautiful. Hey guys, what do you guys think of the color? I would be interested in getting your feedback. For those of you who are still uh, watching this live, what do you think of this color? What do you think of this color? Thank you. Thank you for the likes, guys. Appreciate it. Remember, every single like helps uh, the TikTok algorithm to push our content to more and more people. At the end of the day, the outcome should be that we should be reaching out to thousands of people every time we do lives, and we should be sharing our content uh, with more people as possible. And the niche is, is that I like to share this content with people that admire and love American classics, American muscle cars, and American hot rods. Um, root beer? Uh, sort of. Sort of, yes. Yeah. I could see that. Uh, however, you would have to see this uh, color in the sunlight. It reflects differently. Um, so, there we go. And guys, these door jams, I mean, we don't just do jams, guys. We do the whole thing. Again, there is no shortcuts in what we do. This is the whole door, guys, not just the jams. Remember, this car was an originally white car. And an example, that is a trunk, okay? A lot of body shops out there, if you're going for a repaint, are not going to strip this whole trunk down and shoot every single square inch of the backside of a trunk. They will not do it unless you ask for it. And um, some shops will not probably do it because they'll tell you they don't have time to do it. Um, I only take on a certain amount of cars a year. Um, so this is one that I got in. I rushed in. Real good client again. So we rushed this one in here to get it done. Um, I'm going to push this Mustang as far as possible, um, without losing the immaculate, immaculate quality that I strive for on it. Thank you, James. I appreciate it, sir. So yeah, she beautiful. And, uh, there's a car right there, guys. You know, nothing fancy. It's your uh, everyday run of the mill 1995 Ford Mustang convertible with a very shitty 3.8 liter V6. That is out of the car. And uh, stay tuned. And if you're not following us, follow us so you can see what's going to go into that Mustang as far as a motor and transmission. Uh, you guys are going to be really pleased with the amount of horsepower this thing is going to be putting out. I will have to say, though, uh, we're not going to hot rod the hell out of this car. This car needs to be a turnkey car for the, for the client where he could just jump in, turn the key, and drive it. If he wants to drive this thing every day, he has that option. So I am not going to be pushing this car too far as far as performance um, because this is just a cruise and enjoy on the weekends car for the client. However, he wanted a one-off Mustang um, that's designed buy classic steel auto works to suit his needs so that's where we're going let's just say that this this mustang will